Well, my, Vice President Mike Pence was in town today making a stop stumping for a Senate candidate. We have more now from Mark Curtis. It was a raucous night as approximately 400 people gathered at a business inside the North Central West Virginia airport. Vice President Mike Pence campaigning for Republican Senate nominee Patrick Morrissey, currently the Attorney General of West Virginia. Morrissey is locked in a tight battle with Senator Joe Manchin. Today I'll make your promise. You sent Patrick Morrissey to the United States Senate with renewed Republican majorities. We're going to secure our border. We're going to build the wall. We're going to close the loopholes. Vice President uh, Pence really did a great job laying out the contrast. I'm the conservative fighter who's going to help West Virginia, help advance the Trump jobs agenda. Joe Manchin is a dishonest Washington liberal. Morrissey believes the tide is turning in this race and that polls showing Manchin with a wider lead are inaccurate. Morrissey believes this is going to be very close. I think we're dead even right now. I know with uh, Vice President Pence coming in, Donald Trump Jr. coming in, uh, President Trump, we're hopeful he's going to come back yet again. The biggest applause of the night went for immigration reform and the performance of the U.S. economy. Pence says he needs Patrick Morrissey to help on those issues in the U.S. Senate. We will make America great again. Let's go get it done. Let's go get it done, West Virginia. This is the second time Pence has campaigned in West Virginia for Morrissey. President Trump has also been here twice. With just over two weeks to go until Election Day, the big question now is will we see any more presidential or vice presidential visits to the Mountain State on behalf of Republican candidates? In Bridgeport, I'm Moore Curtis, 12 News.